God is good all the time. Turn to your neighbor and say, good to see you. Say something nice. Say it's like, you're looking good. If you're a single guy and there's a girl next to you, this is uh, your time. Amen. Come on. Well, I want to just welcome you guys to our Wednesday night youth service. How many of you guys enjoying so far this time in church? Amen. How, how's that second song that Martin did? Jump around. That was a, he took it to a whole nother level. <laughs> I didn't see where my grandma was because it's too dark. <laughs> I'm pretty sure she was jumping around, Martin. So way to go. Well, to be honest with you, uh, when it comes to Wednesday night, um, church is the best place to be. You know, not because of uh, lights, cool people, great message. But I believe our church is different church. Our church has a vision and purpose. You know what I mean? You know, to have just building and come here, sing songs, hear another message, to leave, it does not make church. What makes church is a purpose. You know why you come in here. And our church purpose is simply to win souls and make disciples. We don't car him just to waste our two hours, leave, listen to the sermons, and go back home the same. It reminds me of the story I heard this lady about this car and a dealership actually dropped the car at her uh, home and it was a brand new car it was amazing she paid a lot of money for it 24 hours she calls back the dealership she says you guys ripped me off this car does not work properly i want my money back come and get your car salesman's like well what's going on can we somehow fix it she's like this car works during the day does not work during the night she's like okay that's weird car is brand new how what do you mean works during the day it does not work during the night so he gets his mechanic on and she's like well maybe our mechanic can help you out she's like okay so mechanic gets on the phone he's like what's wrong well how can we help you she's like during the day i put in d day mode and the car drives when the night comes i put in n night mode the car stands <laughs> and the mechanic's like okay <laughs> it's one of those <laughs> Like, well, it's easy to fix and actually stands for neutral, you know. So if you girls here struggling with this problem, there you go. This revelation was enough alone for you to come to church. Amen? Amen. But listen, this is how church is. We can have the best music, the best lights, great sermon. But if we don't have vision and purpose, it's like we sit in that car in the night mode and not moving nowhere. You know, and our what is... Our purpose is to win souls and make disciples. That means the friends that you have, the family that you have that do not, do not know Jesus. I guys have to admit to you, Pastor Vlad is not going to save them. I wish Pastor Vlad can go to every one of our friends, to our house, and to our work and save them. If he could, I probably would bump my tie to like 12%. <laughs> but he can't. Because Pastor Vlad, he has his own thing. He preaches, he prays at church. Each one of us, every person that comes here, you're just not a visitor. You're a leader. You're the light. You are the only person that some people will see, the Christian, the Bible, the God in their lives. You could be the only Bible that somebody will read. So I encourage you, step it up. We made these cards. I personally designed these. So it will break my heart if I see them just sitting there. So do me all a favor, grab like 20 and just make it rain. <laughs> you know, we used to, a long time, me and my, uh, Miguel, my Mexican friend, we used to make a bunch of flyers, just go on the bridge here, overpass, and just make it rain. <laughs> and we ran quick. Any, anyways, but don't spread them like this, cost money. But... You know, it's simple. I, I caught myself. How do I evangelize? Everybody is on Friday going home. Everybody's talking about football. Like, man, you going to watch it, watch it. I'm like, no, man, I'll probably just watch highlights. Why, why not? Like, oh, I'm in church. I'll probably just record it or watch highlights. Oh, cool. And right away I ask, do you go to church? Like, no, man. I just simply like, hey, you should come check it out. Here's the car. Boom. I just got my light on. <laughs> and that's how you get your shine on. There you go, people. It's simple. Another thing we have, we have an app. Come on, people. We are in 21st century. Our church officially has an iPhone app. So please do us all a favor. Download it. Rate it. 
comment, only good things. Keep the negative to yourself. We have website. If your friend is really socially not awkward, doesn't want to have, he can sit at home, drink his mocha, and watch us on live service. You know, it's no problem. We have every tool that you need to evangelize. Because at the end of the day, it's all about the souls. It's all about people missing hell and going to heaven. It's all about people developing relationship with God the creator, the one that created them. At the end of the day, when we, everything, when at the end of the day, and when we die, the only thing will matter is what we've done for Christ. Everything else will not matter. The car, the house, the wife, the girlfriend, the boyfriend, the cat. Yeah, cat won't matter, definitely. <laughs> but I encourage you, step it up. Grab the flyers, spread the word, and we'll see this place packed for Jesus. Amen?